and I hope no one forgets it, man. Honestly, sickening. As human beings, you wouldn't think we would sink any lower than we already have. Spoiler alert, we do. At least this guy does, and he f***ing sucks. Honestly, this is one of the most scumbag things I'd ever seen in a long time. Leave it for an L.A. person to do this, honestly. I've never been to L.A., all I hear is terrible things about it, and seeing someone with the balls and brains to do something as dumb as this, I am honestly going to believe every single word they say about the grimy people there at this point. Of course, not everyone's going to be like that, but this is looking like a new standard to look forward to when it comes to these people, because this guy had the audacity to offer a homeless guy food, buy this food, and then eat it in front of his fucking face. Los Angeles, California has the third biggest homeless population in the United States. And today, it's my job to make sure there's one less hungry person on the streets. Hey, excuse me, sir. Hey, I was wondering, are you hungry by any chance, man? All right, man, I got you. Would you like a baconator, fries, a drink? Is that cool? All right, what's your name, man? Israel. God bless you, Israel. I got you. I'll be right back, man. One baconator combo, please. Yeah, what's up, bro? Yeah, man, I got you a, I got you a Sprite, you know, here. large fry. You a baconator, man. I was homeless myself, so I, I want to make sure you get on the right path. And, you know, you're always able to, you know, get back on your feet. You know, so I, just, I want you to enjoy this. This is really good. All right, take care. Have a nice day. Are you serious, man? You actually have to be joking. And of course, he had to record it and post the shit on social media. The tools in the shed can't get any sharper than this, I guarantee you that. What the fuck, man? Clout demon energy, for real. I saw this motherfucker's YouTube channel, only 9k subs. So you know this guy is fucking desperate for some attention and some clout. I don't know why this guy thought that this was a good idea and that this was going to blow up. Yeah, it did blow up. It got people's attention in the way you definitely didn't want it to. Because at this point, any faucet of you getting a goddamn online career now is dead as fuck. Do you want to support a guy who's going to flex food in front of a goddamn homeless person? I sure as hell don't. It's 2023 and people are thinking that they're going to get famous by treating other human beings like shit. You cannot make this up. We've just, we've come to a point where our minds get the best ideas. If someone is starving and suffering in their day-to-day -day life, just trying to find anything that they can to push through and just simply live, and we know their stomach is aching from constant days of not eating, fuck it, rather than giving him food, how about we eat that food in front of his fucking face? And then we can get internet famous. So we can eat even more food in front of people's faces. And just mock everybody else that we share this goddamn planet with. How about that? That's an amazing idea. You gotta disregard life in of itself to do something this fucking heinous. This disrespectful. This fucking dirty. To be honest. This shit honestly is getting me mad because this is some spoiled, privileged bullshit, man. It's hard to even boil it down to clout or money, but like, you already know that was the objective here. I don't know why for a second that this guy thought being a scumbag would actually help him out in the end and give him the money and clout that he wants. What in the name of God was going through this guy's head before he did this? He genuinely thought people are going to love watching me eat food in front of someone that is starving. You know, that's someone's father and brother right there. That is another living, breathing person. Now, if I was hungry and someone did that to me, what the fuck, man? You think I'm going to like that? No one is going to like that shit. Did this guy not think that anyone was going to sympathize with the homeless man? You know how many homeless people ask me for fucking food? And I want to give it to them. But I'm not fucking financially stable my damn self at times. And I just can't give it to them. 
It's a sucky fucking feeling not being able to give food to homeless people. And this guy can perfectly do that. And here he is just eating it in front of his face. These homeless people are so down bad that they have to ask people for food, man. Did anyone even try and think about that, how they feel, how much it sucks having to ask someone for food? No one chooses to be fucking homeless. That is definitely one thing I think everyone gets fucked up. And I will admit, they definitely do things to get themselves in that position. So hey, they might be where they need to be. But at the end of the day, they don't deserve any more bullshit than they already got going on in their fucking lives. Because even then for them, the bare minimum is just survival. Now taking that and trying to turn it into some kind of online fucking parody is just sick, man. Honestly, sick. And I hope to God that this guy does not get anywhere else on this fucking internet shit. Because I hate to wish bad things on people, but when you give power to people like this, it is just completely fucked, man. If someone's going to go as far as to mocking someone and eating food in front of their faces, imagine what they're going to do if they get billions of dollars. There's no filter, no respect, no common decency for the fellow man that they share the day with. None of that. And that is just fucking criminal and horrible to watch. Honestly, inhumane to say. Like, what kind of fucking reaction was this guy expecting? He should have definitely been expecting a negative one in the slightest. Because this guy right here, honestly, really just posted this shit and thought that it was going to get him famous. Like, did this guy think a single post was going to guarantee a fucking online career, no matter how controversial it is? People have no idea what it takes to do this social media shit in the slightest. Everyone is so quick to do some grimy shit for a fucking free shortcut to get where they want to be. Little do they realize what it actually takes and what kind of real sacrifices they have to make to actually get what the fuck they want. No one wants to fucking work, man. And I'm tired of seeing that. But they're going to piss on someone else the second they can to get what they want. Fuck that, man. I don't care about how this homeless guy got homeless or anything like that. But what I do know is another man should not be taunting and mocking another man for the sake of a fucking number on a phone screen. This motherfucker doesn't even have enough clout to even get paid off of this shit. So he's literally getting nothing in the end of doing this grimy bullshit. And it's exactly what he deserves. He deserves to get nowhere on his socials for posting some bullshit like this. And I hope no one forgets it, man. Honestly, sickening. It pisses me the fuck off. I've been seeing nothing but really standard reactions to this. I think people need to be a lot more angry about this situation because we're literally taking other human beings and turning them into fucking content. We're taking another person's suffering, another person's starvation, and trying to make a check out of it. What the fuck kind of dark web bullshit are people stooping to just for some fucking online recognition, just for some attention one little wave of attention and then just like that your career can be fucking over and that is the funniest thing that none of these clout demons realize i hate to say it but just exactly that is going to happen to this guy because of this damn post the lack of self-awareness is at an all-time high score of ignorance this guy eventually starts to feel guilty and make an attempt into actually giving the same homeless guy food, but it turns out that the guy is not even there. I didn't really think I was that mean, right? Oh no, he's gone. Where'd he go? Where did he go? Where did he go? Yo, did you see a black guy walk past her? What the f You guys wanna f uh, Nah, we don't want none of that shit. So yeah, go with that bullshit. Hey, nah, OG's chill, cause bullshit. OG's cool with it, so here. I feel bad, but at least I did something good. There's one thing you can also take into consideration. Maybe this entire post is fake, but even then, if you're faking this shit, it's just gonna get you 
nowhere on any fucking platform. If people actually want the clout, want the money, want a successful career and fans that will actually fuck with them, they have to put in the work and stop trying to make all these bullshit shortcuts by doing artificial fake shit and just fucked up shit in general. Where is the integrity? Where is the honor? Where is the self-respect? Honestly, if this is fake or not, I sure as hell could not tell. But regardless, I'm seeing a piece of shit eat food in front of a man that is hungry. That is not okay. And if anyone thinks this is okay, anyone is defending this shit, I'm sorry, but you really have some fucked up values in life. Because there's no way you can justify eating food in front of someone who needs food. And doing it just for the sake of doing it, especially when you already know that this person is hungry as fuck. It is not right. There is no justification. This is literally fucking torture. I don't care how anyone shapes it or wants to look at it. This is honestly fucking torture in broad fucking daylight. Mentally fucking with this man on the sidewalk who's damn sure struggling way more than this guy ever could for just to spend another second on this goddamn planet. This guy was looking like such an asshole and such a piece of shit trying to give this guy some food, realizing he was gone, because that's when the fucking guilt was kicking in. Dumbass move, man. You know why that guy left? Because who the fuck wants to be put through that? That shit is fucking sad. I'm starving on the side of the fucking road, and someone is literally just gonna mock the way I'm feeling? It's already bad enough that I can't fucking shower, but I can't fucking eat. And you're going to put food in my fucking face? Are you serious right now? We're really looking at human beings because they're lesser. Because they don't have materialistic shit. They don't have a house. They don't have a car. Just because they don't have fucking money. We're looking at them as if they're beneath us. That's exactly why this guy did this shit. Because there's no respect for homeless people. People just look at homeless people as if they're all pieces of shit. And that is not how it is, man. All these people are human beings too, and they've been through some shit. Some of them deserve to be where they're at, some of them don't. But does that justify treating them like shit? Fuck no. Not in a million years. They do nothing to anyone. All they did was take out their bad decisions in life on themselves. Do they really deserve another person to shit on their life more than they already did? Come on now, it's already bad enough for them to sleep on the fucking concrete, but to have people openly mock them and record that shit for other people to see, I'm just blown away, man. This one, I really did not expect this one to get me so wild up, or even, like, I just never thought anyone would just be this stupid and this much of an asshole to actually do this shit and think that it was gonna work. It's just... It baffles me, guys. It really, truly does. Now, what if this homeless guy would have squared up on his ass for disrespecting him like this? He would have probably looked like the fucking bad guy because someone would have just boiled it down to, oh, no, nah, it's another homeless guy just tweaking, not knowing any of the context. People can eat food in front of a homeless guy's face, and if a homeless guy tries to do something about it, he's just going to look like the bad guy in the fucking end. And I guarantee you, that's exactly the way the wind blows on this one. This scumbag behavior doesn't deserve to be on social media, nor does it need a platform in the slightest. I'm done here. I, I just can't. I'm done.